is, first and foremost, a no-shushing worship service. It's interactive, it's progressive, it's a very welcoming space. Parables is just this experience for people who, as we say, seem to be lost on the margins. These folks that come to Parables not only get been burned by church, but they've been burned by society. I saw an article in the Sun-Times about parables, and I also have a daughter who's severely disabled. And other churches we had gone to, I was always uncomfortable during the services if she would have seizures or make loud noises. So, you know, I read in the article that it was an inclusive service where you didn't have to worry about those types of things. It puts people who are generally pushed to the margins at the center to be our teachers. So that level of diversity and the, the needs of people with special needs, they become our teachers of humility. We do activities and crafts and clay pots, put little gifts and things in them that Leanne gave us. It's nice to be around people that have disabilities. They've helped me with my faith. It's a very inviting atmosphere. Anyone can come, no matter race, gender, size, disabilities. It's very inclusive. Everybody in it all together, I guess, is the thing. It's just everybody coming together at one time for one purpose, to celebrate not only how God's working in their life, but how we can work with God together to make a better world. People arrive generally just before the service. Welcome! As they come in the door, Sasha is usually there to greet them, and there's people who are just so looking forward to her when they get here every week. And they come in, they get their movement scarves, they get their fidgets. There's a fellow who plays the organ, and there's other people who will immediately dash up to me and go, what do I get to read today? What can I, can I do the communion bread? During the worship service, when the students get up and participate, everybody's taking an active part in reading. That, that really is a joyful moment. The messages Leanne delivers every week are simplified so they can be understood by the people who come to this service who would not necessarily understand a typical sermon in a regular church. But at the same time, they still minister to me and they teach me something as well. There's immediately so much excitement and noise. I think if a traditional church member came in, they would be surprised at how much excitement there was. There's just like a level of delight in one another. Some people that aren't even affiliated with the church that just love coming here and being part of this experience. The ever-encompassing love that is radiated by every person here, it's enormous.